Hey everybody, uh, I have gotten really behind on my tea videos. So I'm going to do the month of April and I'm going to do the month of May. So that way I can go ahead and get both of them knocked out. As for April, April was, <sighs> April was an okay month. Um, my, favorites in this but we're gonna start off with the well I don't have any nighttime left by Puka um, that was a, um, like a nighttime tea to make you go to sleep it had lavender oat flour and lime flour in it um, and that one out of all of these I would say was my favorite because it did help me go to sleep um, the next one is society and that came like this and it came loose leaf and it's got dried it looks like dried flowers in it is really cool I'll see if I can pull one of these out because I just I think that's really neat to have in your tea <laughs> how cool is that this one smells really mint um, really good um, this is Um, it has green tea in it. This one was really good, just not my favorite. And then King's Light by Train Bar. This one. And this one also is really like loose leaf inside, and you can see all the flower and um, peppermints and blackberry leaves and rhubarb pieces. Um, so it's got a lot of fruit taste to it. This one also contains caffeine. Um, this is a refreshing and delicate tea. It was good, just wasn't my favorite. And then there was Tulsa Hibiscus by Organic India. This also is caffeine free. Um, this has holy basil in it. It supports stress, mood, and immune system. Um, and it's traditional hibiscus purifies the heart. I'm not really a hibiscus fan hot. Um, if it's code, then yeah, I like it. Um, you can drink this code, um, but as far as being straight, hibiscus just really isn't my thing. So that is the month of April. Now, May was an amazing month. Uh, I got to taste the favorite tea I've ever had in my entire life. So we're going to jump in and we're going to start with the macaron, macaron, mint. Chocolate by Ches Lulu. This is like sitting in Paris at night watching the sun or the stars come out. This was heaven in a cup. Like literally heaven in a cup. This was a caffeine free. It already had all the, the sugar tasting that you needed for a tea. You didn't have to add honey or anything. It had white cocoa butter coconut blossom sugar natural mint flavor and it did contain coconut this right here is the louis vuitton of tea best tea i have ever tasted in my life next is the matcha latte mix by four sigmatic this um it's got the organic coconut milk powder organic, organic matcha powder organic coconut palm sugar lion's mane extract um, and it's already got all the, the, the sweetness that you need in it. Um, I'm not big on matcha, but if you love matcha, this is definitely the way to go because you just take this, put it in your, your hot water, stir it, boom. You don't even have to add anything. So this was really great. Next is Ginger Lemon by Red Rose. This one right here. Uh, this one smells really good. Um, this has ginger, licorice, lemon, lemongrass, orange peel, peppermint, lemon oil. This is a cleansing tea that is a treat for your tummy. Um, this really works well if you have a stomach ache, if you have bloating, if you ate crappy the night before and you need to pick me up the next day, this is your tea. And then last but not least is White Peach Berry Jasmine Pearl by Churchill's Fine Tea. This does have low caffeine. This is Mood, Moodin White Tea, Hand Road Jasmine Pearls, Peaches, and Strawberries. And it's high in antioxidants. 
and it smells like heaven. It's very fruity. Um, mm, just it, it smells really good. This one was not necessarily my favorite, but if you love like a fruity, sweet tea, um, this would be up your alley. So out of the two months that I've done, uh, May has definitely been my favorite. That Chick Tag Lulu. I hope Sips gets more stuff from them because literally, oh, that tea was heaven. I'm going to buy me some. Uh, but yeah, um, go check them out. You get different teas every month. So you can try all kinds of teas from everywhere. Um, it's a great thing. They're a great company. Um, yeah, I mean, who doesn't love hot tea at night, you know, but uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.